Hey guys, so this weekend we are in the Grison in Flims and we are going to take you with us in these beautiful lakes and hikes. Yes, <laughs> and we'll show you around. Yeah, come on, let's go. Hi, so we are in the Kur train station and we're going to take a bus, a postal bus. That's something pretty use, um, useful and unusual in uh, Switzerland. And we're going to take the B81 to Flims and Lax. We are in Flims. We are in the Waldhaus bar, so a bit further up from the village. And it's a nice place, I think, because it's closer to uh, all the lakes and the heights. And uh, here yeah, we're gonna get to our hotel, actually. Actually, I think this is our Keza Hotel, which, is, which has a nice restaurant. So we are here just next to the forest and we're gonna take the Wanderweg 252 I think to go get and see the Karmasee. So we are going downhill. We can see the color of the lake and with the sun I really recommend coming here when it's sunny. It's beautiful but we'll show you the lake when it's fully uncovered. What do you think? <laughs> it's amazing actually. Yeah. yeah. I rarely see a lake that clear and blue turquoise like this, so, so I'm impressed. So we sat down, had a picnic, and now we are going around the lake. You can go around the lake if you are within the vicinity of the Kamaze, and we're gonna have different perspective of the lake. So what it said was that the walk was going to take 20 minutes and I think what we are quickly finding out is that it's not going to take 20 minutes, it's going to take longer because we keep stopping to take pictures, but look at the way the lake looks. I mean, come on. Yeah. Come on. What are we supposed to do? So beautiful. So this is the bottom of the lift. It has six people, at least for now with COVID. And it can be pretty helpful. Okay, so we just took the funicular up and I would suggest it in my amazing. opinion. The view is really nice and it's a bit less tiring. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You get a cool view of the lake. It's beautiful, um, actually. Yeah. You have like the all the trees lake. and the mountains. Yeah. Almost and it's as nice. if we were uh, a drone a little bit. <laughs> yeah, so the landing point for the funicular is also cool to just take a nice view of it. Yeah. But it's right here. It's operating during COVID. We have six people at a time and if you're staying in a hotel it's free. Otherwise I think it's like twelve francs, but I don't exactly know how because there was nobody there. Yeah, I think for now they're not charging uh, for it. Yeah, charging, but usually getting into that area is uh, is twelve francs, yeah. but it's free or cheaper if you are if you have that uh, yeah. guest card. Yep. So we are tr following that six fifty nine that goes to Rin Alta, and we want to go to Rin Alta and Il Spier and. Starting from here, it should not go up too much. That Louis, tell us where we are. So we are in uh, close to the source of the Rhine that you can see there, that forms a cold canyon. And we are close to that Ilspir, 
uh, that we're going to see in five, ten minutes from here. It is very cool. It's very cool. So this is the Rhine, which is the same river that you can swim in in Basel. Yeah. So we are. Uh, at, yes, we are. Here yeah, they call it Rheinschlucht. On Google, it's called Il Spir, S P I R. If you want, and it's a cool panoramic view. And so you have that Rhine, I think it's like tens of kilometers away, but not that far that the Rhine takes its sources. So we are, I think, 15 minutes away from the Crestesee and it would be continuing to the right, but we're going to first go see that Filsbach Schulst, <laughs> which apparently is a canyon that was indicated on the maps. So we're gonna try, it's a little bit uh, more of a forest pass compared to what we've had so far. So, so far from Flims to here, it's been only downhill, pretty nice chill walk. You can go come here with strollers and it's a uh, it's fine here maybe for this part maybe not so much but uh, to go to the Crestase from Flims it's pretty nice so we can now hear the river or the canyon pretty well And still very well indicated, so let's go. So I think 10 minutes or even 5 minutes uh, from the Slot Canyon and that uh, waterfall that is the Crestasee. There it is, the Crestasee. Like we said, there's like the little area to get food and drinks and there's a little picnic kind of table area there. And then these kind of docks almost have stairs into the river. You can just hang out. But yeah, it is very nice. You yeah. see the mountains there and you can see, I'll show you how clear the water is. It almost looks like a pool over here. But it's not that same kind of turquoise color, but the water is very, very clean. Yeah, so it's not about being clean, it's just different minerals in the water reflect differently, but very beautiful. So you can just walk right in and swim and it is really empty. I think you can tell from the footage we'll show you of Kalmazay, this is definitely less oh, crowded definitely, and it's yes. the same weekend. So if you don't want to hang out with the crowds and still want a nice lake experience in this region, this is a great option. And I think you can actually rent uh, rowboats uh, yeah. here. All right, guys, that was it for us in Flams. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. But that's it for us. We'll catch you in the next one. Hey, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, please make sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you soon.